Franklin came to us from a neglect case. He was rejected by his mother. It's okay, we'll get you home soon. We knew immediately we wanted to help him. It really hurt to think about the fact that he was alone, so we jumped at the opportunity to offer him a forever home. Baby boy. Bringing Franklin home was a really unique experience. The first couple nights, we had Franklin sleep in the house with us, and I can just remember <laughs> him falling asleep on us. Franklin, what was that? He loves going along for walks. <laughs> Let's go. He hops on all four <laughs> legs, which is hilarious. It's just the, the sweetest thing to see. <laughs> Yay. Shortly after we brought Franklin home, Dakota was found as a stray, so we adopted him. She's a good boy. There was a moment where okay, Franklin yeah. and Dakota saw each other for the first time. Oh my goodness, you go easy on him, huh? You could see Franklin sort of doing a headbutt motion and Dakota being just overly excited about that. Get you, Dakota. A good boy, Dakota. The first thing that they did was take off running <laughs> and chase each other. It's almost like a competition. And they both just dart away and go as fast as they can towards the house. Don't follow that dog all the way. <sighs> Franklin immediately had a different personality given his rough past. I think Franklin has become more outgoing after becoming friends with Dakota. Not only does Franklin know his own name, but he also gets excited and recognizes Dakota's name as well. Dakota! <laughs> Dakota just naturally seems to take on the role of big brother. I think he keeps a special eye on him. He has such a heartwarming character. They have such a special bond. It makes us feel good to know that they have each other and blossom with each other's friendship. You could see both of them light up. Franklin really found his family with us and just happy to have a second chance at life. <laughs> 